Great, here we go. Hi, hi Amazon. I'm Leah Little. Today we're going to talk about beauty and uh, a few things. Probably not makeup, mainly skincare, a little behind the scenes tips. Uh, with over 20 years on television and 20,000 hours of being live, I've picked up a few little things along the way and I'm glad to share them with you. I get lots of questions about how do you do this or how do you do that? Or um, today's not, <laughs> actually today's a perfect day to do beauty because this is pretty much a regular day for me. I haven't been able to wash my hair yet and we're kind of doing all kinds of things on the fly, but that's life, right? That's how we roll. So uh, here we go. So I'm gonna give you a little preview of some of the things that we're gonna do and let me just show you uh, if you want to have some of the best dry shampoo you've got it coming up we are also going to say a big hello to the silk infusion so if you have dead ends oh I'm embarrassed to say it's been too long since those have been cut great little secret here for taking care of those will you click on the sheet as well Jamie's here helping me and what do we have next uh, the pride uh, Oh, oh, these are going to be great for um, fashion tape. This is going to be terrific if you want to secure a blouse in place, maybe a hem came out, whatever the case might be from the uh, Hollywood Fashion Secrets. We're going to talk quite a bit about that because it's been a great, great help, especially if you are doing video work or you're in front of the, um, the camera and you need to, you know, hold different pieces to it. We can do that for you. And, okay. One of my all-time favorites from Clarins. If you have more fair skin and you want to look like you have some dimension, you want to look like you have some uh, contrast, this is going to be a terrific, terrific option from Clarins. It is a uh, self-tanning milk, and I swear by it, especially in the winter months. So as much as I love the sun, when I go out into the sun, I slather down in sunscreen, but uh, it's nice to just have that... Um, beautiful golden glow. So great answer here. We're going to be talking about that. And one of my favorites, always, if you are a woman of a certain age, then you may want to try out the Pride Ageless Decolletage Cream. This is not only for those of us girls that are a few decades in to our beauty regimes, but also is great to begin. You don't have to be, you know, a spring chicken to start on it. Dallas is coming to say hello. <laughs> You want to meet Dallas? Come here, baby. Come here. 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 Okay. Right here. Right here. Oh, I can't even pick you up. You're getting so heavy. Oh, there he is. Dallas. Can't hear us talking in the bathroom without coming to say hello, can you? Mwah. <laughs> Mwah. Oh. Okay. Now. Let's talk about <laughs> more beauty. Uh oh, we won't do that. No, 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 no. Let's take them back out. Come on, Dallas. Out you go. Out you go. Out you go. We're going to ask Victoria. Okay. Let's move on. I'm going to talk to you about also my favorite skincare with Obagi. This is crazy. The cleanser that I've used for many, many years. Dallas, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Nothing like life. Come on. Come on. Go, go, go. Oh, my So, nothing like working from home. Ah, I love this. So, let me say hello in the chat room. I would love to chat with you and say thank you for being here. So, let me just type that in as well and all right so um so what did we just share with you so that was the obagi so i use the uh, i use both the cleanser as well as the toner and thank you <laughs> and i i like the foaming gel so this is the cleanser I use almost every day, and then the toner goes right on top of it, and there's some other steps to Obagi, um, but those are sort of the, um, the key to the system. So uh, we'll talk a little bit about that. And then also the uh, Estee Lauder Night Repair Cream. This has been 
a favorite of mine for years and years and years. Whether you use it underneath your eyes, whether you use it on the back of your hands, this is just, in my opinion, one of the best um, moisture repair systems that's out there. I put it right up there with my pry system. So great solution there. Also, let's talk about these. These are, <laughs> this might be the coolest little beauty gadget that I have found in decades. This is a little eyebrow shaper. So if you want to just do, you know, maybe you are somebody, I do threading, um, but I haven't been to the salon to do threading in a long time. So this is a great little way to just get those little baby hairs right up along the brow line. And I'll show you how to use that in just a little while. So really cool, cool gadget. All right, and then along those same lines, <clears throat> now for the last, uh, 33 or so years I had acrylic nails. I don't now. Uh, that's because of, you know, how things have been changed in, in life. And so being without them, I, I was uh, very glad to get some healthy nails back. No judging if you have uh, acrylic nails. I still love them. I'm sure one day I will get them again. But because I had um, acrylic nails for so long, I found that having this uh, great little clipper tool was really useful because I found my cuticles being very dry and I just wanted to get in there like the pros. So I put that into our little beauty tips and tricks for you today. And what else are we gonna talk about? We have, oh, the oldest oil. If you ever want just to pick me up, this is a, a, an amazing oil that I have actually first discovered back well, was 17 years ago with my massage therapist and she would put it into a little cotton ball and put it into the face cradle as I was getting the massage and there's something just so calm. I just feel my shoulders sort of like <laughs> drop when I just take a, a scent of it. It's just a, a sniff of it. It's just amazing. So that is there in the carousel. We'll be talking more about that. And then also, Okay, you want a really fantastically inexpensive good secret? Somebody turned me on to this years ago. I can't. I think it was somebody that I met my hairdresser. I can't remember, but it is a fantastic moisturizer for your hair. And it's from L'Oreal. And it's mega moisture. And so if you are looking for an alternative to some of the things that you might use um, on a more ritzy sort of scale and you just want something that's a really great deep conditioner on a budget, this is going to be a terrific way to go. So that's from L'Oreal Nature's Therapy. And I like the Mega Moisture. Here, I'll just give a little sneak preview. Look at that. Oh, doesn't that smell so good, too? Oh, I love the way that smells. So that is the Nature's Therapy Mega Moisture. And finally, from my friend Laura, I think I'm going to be giving her a phone call uh, because I'd love to do a, an Amazon Live with her and talk about this whole line of products. She uh, actually um, put together this essential oil blend and customized it so that it was a blend that could help you fall asleep. And I have to tell you, I was cynical at first. I don't think there's anything wrong with being cynical about products. You want to see if they work for you. Some may work for you, some may work for me, some may work for both of us. This one, I was astounded. It literally helped me get to sleep. So if you want to read about it, Quiet Brain is the name of the product. You take the smallest amount and you put it right on the back of your neck. I'll show you in just a little while. And uh, just before you go to sleep, I wouldn't do it right now. Um, although uh, Laura says there are uses that you could have during the day, but I definitely find that it sort of de-stresses me. And, uh, makes me much more calm and ready to fall asleep. In fact, it's almost like it's almost like that oldest oil relaxes me, just smelling it takes me back to uh, my massage therapist. The the quiet brain <laughs> makes me almost start to like fall asleep. It's amazing how beauty products do that, isn't it? How you get into a routine with them and uh, you just sort of uh, you start to feel that way when you're when you're using them. And that's that's the whole reason for it, right? To uh, to give us that calming and that beauty, which I think, and I just want to say this right off the bat, I think beauty comes from the inside out. I really don't think there's anything that you can put on, slather on, smell, sniff, spray in your hair that is gonna make you beautiful uh, without having a beautiful inner glow. 
So that said, let's get started with the stuff we can put on. Oh, and by the way, you can hold it all in our perspection. I love this. So Julie, who invented this entire line, I only put one of them in the carousel today because I didn't want to have to, you know, uh, 500 of <laughs> the different styles. I don't know how many styles are there. Probably a dozen different styles. This is a makeup bag. It's a travel companion. It zips up so nothing comes out. You could use it for, you know, like I said, traveling. You could use it to take to the office. I use um, mine, actually. Has half my makeup in it. This is my everyday one. Um, and I use it for my makeup so that if I need to you know, throw the makeup in the car because I'm going into the studio to shoot, I can take that with me um, or, you know, take it right out of my purse, put it in the bathroom, and it's here and ready to go. So love that with um, perspection. I'll take you on a full tour of that as well. Okay, let's get started and we're gonna break down this beauty regime. Like I said, this is gonna be for um, mainly skincare and little tips. And later on down the line, we'll do something with makeup. Pardon me, a little dehydrated <laughs> today. Okay, let's start. Um, we're gonna start first of all with Martino's Top Dirty to Me. I discovered this in my uh, workplace, and I have to say that I've tried a lot of different uh, shampoos, uh, dry shampoos that is, to use in between shampoos for your hair. And I have really fine um, hair, lots of it, very thick, and straight as a stick. I mean like straight. So any curl that you see in it has been added to it. In this case, it was added to it yesterday. Um, so what I love about this is that whether you live in a really humid area like I do here in Florida and St. Pete, or whether you are just so busy busy on, on, and on the go and you don't want to wash your hair every day because you don't want to dry it out, if you have hair like mine that is fine but thick, could be thin too, um, gets oily here at the base but dry at the ends, this is a great solution for you. Now, in order of uh, saving my lungs and Jamie's lungs, he's helping me. I'm not going to spray this all over the bathroom because uh, we might fumigate get ourselves out of here. But I will tell you, we'll give you a little idea. I like to put it right wherever I need a little lift, right? So let's just do, let's do this side. Um, so in lieu of hairspray, and I really like this too when I need to get my roots done, just like I need to do now. It's a little bit wet, and if I really wanted to high lift, I would just flip my head upside down and do it that way. But right now, I'm just gonna fluff it a little bit. And it gives you that body, but it does it without, um, without you know, that crispy hairspray look. So what I, what I love about that is that it dries it, and I can use it just at the, uh, just at the roots, because at the ends, I don't need that. I have super, super dry ends because of you know, processing hair color and all that sort of thing. So. I think you, you know, kind of get the idea. And look at that, it just falls really naturally. I love the fact that it doesn't leave any color, really doesn't leave any residue. Um, for years, I used baby powder, and I thought, really, do you need to have a, a, a set dry shampoo that, you know, you spend separate, you know, amounts of money on? And I have come to the conclusion that, yes, you do, because this is worth it. And it is Martino, talk dirty to me. <laughs> Catchy little name, isn't it? And uh, it really does does the trick when you want that little pick me up. And you can see, look how fluffy it is on that side. <laughs> and we have to just even that out. But I, uh, again, we've got a lot to talk about here, so I don't want to spray that again. So you definitely want to use this with your <laughs> fan on in the bathroom. Well worth it. Step outside if you need to. I just have a smaller bathroom here, but um, really highly recommend Martino. Talk dirty to me if you want to have a great dry shampoo. All right, now let's talk about the other end of our hair. A little hair stuck in my mouth. And that is gonna be something for you if, like me, you have really dry ends. Maybe your hair's processed, maybe, uh, like me, you use straightening irons or curling tools or, you know, really, even if you use, you know, some of the titanium and some of the, you know, more safe tools that are out there as far as, the, as for your hair, 
they can still be damaging because anytime you put heat on there, anytime you put metal on there, it's just going to happen. So what's the solution? I found Qi, the silk infusion. Now I've tried a lot of different oils. I've tried a lot of different brands. This just happens to be what works for me. Now I will say I've had, um, makeup artists and stylists put oil on my hair before they ran a, um, a curling tool over it. And honest to God, I found like it was crisp my hair and waved my hair. Um, I don't get angry very much, but that was really problematic at the time. So be careful where you use it and how you use it. Um, uh, it didn't happen to me with this particular brand, but I reserved the oil just for my ends. So it's only literally like the last two inches of my hair that I use it on. So I just ordered this from Amazon. <laughs> so you can get some really great values when it comes to the Chi oil. And it's in your carousel now. So if you have never tried it, today would be a great day to try it out for yourself. So here's how I use it. Oh, I just took the little lid off of it, the little uh, sticker off of it. So I just use the smallest amount. Just a little, can you see that? And I rub it in my hands first so that my uh, you know, hair isn't all filled with oil. And then I just put it right in the ends. And I take it all the way around to the back. And I just kind of, you know, use my fingers to work it through. And sometimes I'll do it even a little bit higher up in the back if it's a little tangled. And then what's nice about this is that it not only gives the illusion of having healthier ends on your hair, but it also helps the separation. If you want it to fall a certain way, or you're trying to you know, create a different look to it, I wish I could just go back and rewind and show you like a little before and after, <laughs> just from a couple seconds ago, right? From what it looked like to what it looks like now. So now we've got the Martino, Talk Dirty to Me, to kind of do the top so that it is um, sort of dry and holds its place. And then we have the chi oil to address the, um, the ends so that now it looks good as well. So there you have a chi silk infusion. Now there's a lot of different types of chi and um, I will say I've tried a few of them. This is my personal favorite. And one time I even by mistake bought a big bottle of another type of chi and the silk infusion is the one that I recommend because I tried to use the other one in, in lieu of this, not quite the same results. So silk infusion, if you want to try doing what I am sharing with you right now. All right. So that is the silk oops, infusion. All right. Next, let's talk about some fashion secrets. Oh, by the way, your hands will be a little bit oily <laughs> after rubbing that into your hair. I just use the extra and rub it right into my cuticles. So that way, if I'm ever showing jewelry or I'm showing something that is, uh, you know, needs a close up of my hands, it's a great little um, quick fix. And if you don't have oil around, cuticle oil around too, because it will um, absorb. And even now, just as I'm rubbing it in, I'm finding that um, my, my skin is just absorbing it. So it's not as oily as it was even just a minute ago. All right, now let's talk secrets. All right. This is the original fashion tape, the Hollywood secret. So it comes in a nice little sturdy carry case. And what is it? These are little tape strips that are not like regular tape, not even like double stick tape. I don't even know what the secret bonding agent is in here, but they work like a charm. So if you are, uh, you know, wanting to mend a hem without having you know, the time to actually sew it, or you are, I used these on my daughter's uh, skirt last year for, uh, for school when, you know, she's like, oh, wow, my skirt is, the hem is coming out. It's a great solution for that. So just like you might find uh, like on a, a Band-Aid, in your product, you have a little tab that you pull, and then this side is sticky, of course, and so is the other side. So then you're gonna put it wherever you want. Let's just say I wanted to attach 
that shirt to uh, maybe my shirt that I have underneath, the blouse that I have underneath. And then you just detach the other side of the tape. I can find the edge of it. A little close. Can we leave it down? We'll get there. Live TV. Right? Live video. Find the little edge. Okay, well I'll show you this because what does happen is that there you go, you can see how it detaches. What's nice about it is that it is actually repositionable. So you see how it's stuck together, but then I was able to open it up again. So let's do it here. So even though it's super sticky, a lot of times with um, with products like this, you have one shot and then it's you know, and then it's done if you didn't get it on there perfectly. What's great about this is that you're not done after that one shot. Oh, no. Maybe I should have done it so close to my face. <laughs> you can see what I'm doing. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So now, there we go. And there's this second piece. And you can cut them in half if you only needed, you know, a smaller amount of that. And then now, I'm just going to place it on my glass. Now, the cool thing is, you can also stick it to your skin. So that part I've attached to my skin, that part I've attached to my blouse. I'm gonna straighten it up a little bit. And you'll be able to see as we continue to talk here that that won't move. So I really love this if you are, you know, you really need something to just kind of stay in place right where you put it. And it's, you know, it's, it's not there like a super glue, but it's there, you know, where it's gonna hold it in place, which I really, really like. So that is just a quick little look-see at your Hollywood fashion secrets, fashion tape. So that could be hands, that could be holding you know, a microphone on, that could be, uh, you know, in this case, for a blouse, you name it, anywhere you need to have the original fashion tape. I love this. I always keep this in my makeup bag when I'm going into the studio because you just never know when you might need something to, uh, you know, to mend on the go. All right, as we move forward, I'm going to talk about pride. So let's talk about this. I love Prime skincare. This is an entire line, and Kathy Kangas, who is the originator of this line, I first met, um, we were chatting actually on Instagram the other night, I want to say 18 or 19 years ago. Uh, and uh, I was working at a shopping network and uh, we were always just recalling my conversation the other night because the lady who brought it in, Deanna, to the shopping network, I think she said she bought it in 2002. So I've known Kathy now since 2002, which is crazy. And the lives that she has touched with this skincare line are countless. It is a line of skincare that is very aware of um, uh, animal testing. And what's great is that with Pry, you are going to have skincare that really delivers. This is going to be uh, a whole line, but today I'm just gonna talk about the Ageless Decolletage Cream. And if you are somebody, even in your 30s, I think you should start with this. I don't often say should, but <laughs> I think that it applies here because I think you'll be glad that you did. You can never start too early with something like this and it's never too late. With Pry, the decolletage cream, you'll see, look at that, how thick and how rich and how luxurious it is. So you only need the smallest amount. And this is specially formulated for your neck. What I love about Kathy is that she's given us uh, different um, creams, different serums for different parts of our body because you need that, oh, I'm gonna have to pull that back a little bit where I put that fashion tape. You need just the smallest amount, and that might be a little bit much. And then, you know, just put it into that decolletage area. And when I was younger, I thought, oh, you don't need to do anything there. But now, as a woman of a certain age, uh, I'm glad I started when I did. I wish I would have started younger. So, smallest amount, put it in, smells amazing. And there are some 
really incredible ingredients here that I'll go into detail in some other videos to share with you about that um, restore the look of your skin, that can help you hydrate. Uh, the hyaluronic acid is in here again to give that plump, beautiful look to your skin. And uh, you just saw me put it on the back of my hands too. Anything extra, I put on the back of my hands because why not, right? You may as well use what you have. So that is the Cry Decolletage Cream. And as you can see here in my bathroom, <laughs> I have it. That's, that's always there. I didn't just put that there for, <laughs> for this, uh, for this uh, conversation. So there you have it. Um, Cry Ageless. Love this. Love what, uh, what uh, Cry stands for when it comes to um, her passion for dogs and cats and animals and uh, just really good people and really good products. So uh, I'm sure I'll go into more detail um, on a future video with Pry. All right, let's now talk about what we're gonna do after we have you know, used some of our serums. And so if you're going outside and you're really fair like me, if you, um, if you have beautiful, rich, gorgeous color to your skin, this is not for you. This is for you if you need some color. And that is the Clarins uh, self tanning milk. So this is something that I have used for years and years and years. Um, I actually used a different brand for a number of years until my sister actually turned me on to Clarins. And isn't it great to have sisters that can share beauty secrets that we can all kind of come together and, um, and give each other tips. That's exactly what I'm doing for you here right now, passing on the goodness, right? So this is the Clarins, and you need only the smallest amount. I'm not gonna put it on there because I've kind of layered on so much stuff, but just the smallest amount, wherever you wanna have a little bit of contrast. And years and years ago, um, when I had a fantastic mentor um, who uh, was uh, Miss America in the early 80s, she taught me the power of contouring and using um, simple little contours on your face. And although that was, you know, a number of decades ago, I still think it rings true today. Some of those tips and techniques, you can customize them for what works for you and what works for current trends. But I certainly think that there is uh, value in, uh, in some of those lessons, even from years and years ago. So the self tanner is one of those lessons. I love to use it just on my neck from here down. Um, I love to use it on my arms here if I want to have some contouring and uh, anywhere else I want to have some shading. So what I like about this is that you can use it and get a little bit of that contrast. Sometimes I'll use it on the side of my face here, sometimes on the top of my forehead. Anywhere the sun would kiss you is what uh, uh, Debbie told me years and years ago. So this allows me without having to layer on loads of makeup and put on tons of uh, extra powder and maybe you know and layer layer uh, you know on top of there and you look like you have uh, you know this thick crazy layer of makeup it gives you that look and that color and it really is this sort of soft golden glow I mean it's not this obviously it's gonna go with whatever skin tone you have it's gonna transform in that color um, to uh, mix with whatever your natural skin tone is and whatever the blend is will become that contrast. But uh, this is a great one if you have um, light to fair skin, but you also tan sort of easily. I think this is a, a great one to have. It doesn't have that crazy stinky smell. Even if you get a little sweaty out there doing your gardening or working out, it still doesn't have that crazy smell. I don't know about you, but that was a big complaint of mine for years and years when it came to self tanners. It was like, oh, I just can't stand. I just, you know, you want to be cute, but you don't want to be stinky. So <laughs> this is a great, uh, great solution for that with the Clarins. All right. Um, what's nice too is this one has the sunscreen in it as well. All right. So that is our bronzer. Now, let's talk about your skin. Excuse me, I'm so thirsty today. We've been just running around like crazy this morning. All right, we have, I think I put the full size in there for you, didn't I? Okay, the Obagi skincare. I was so excited to find it's here on Amazon. Do you know how hard this is to find in years past. 
I mean, I would pour over and look for it and just try to find a, a place to find it because for a while it was only available in a dermatologist's office and that's actually where I found it and where I originally started using it. Um, gosh, I can't even tell you, maybe 16, 17 years ago. Um, the reason why I like the Obagi skincare line is that I don't like to do anything super invasive. I literally waited until I was 40 years old to have Botox for the first time. I just, that's me personally, no judging. You do what you feel like makes you feel beautiful. But for me, I wanted to do the least invasive first. And so I discovered the Obagi line um, with some friends of mine, some fellow hosts of mine at a shopping network. And what we realized, what, what I realized through learning about it is that it was the only skincare line that I could use regularly that got rid of really dark spots that had been on my face from playing volleyball out in the uh, you know in the sun years and years, and um, this line um, with the uh, there's several different components to it. But step one and step two is a really great beginning. So if you have um, normal to oily skin, I use the foaming gel. There is a gentle cleanser, that's not what I use. I use the foaming gel in the Obagi, and then the toner is the step two. And so what you wanna do with that is put this onto your skin. Let me show you toward the end of this video and I'll just wash off my, my makeup. So you, you put it onto your skin, let it sit for about a minute or so, just the cleanser. Then uh, wash it off with water, just splash water, and then let your skin get kind of tacky and then put the toner on top. So it's not just the product itself, it's how you use the product as well. And uh, I just love Obagi. I know there's lots of changes coming with Obagi. I know there's a new line that's coming out, but this is what I use, so this is what I'm sharing with you right now. And when I find a new favorite or something else comes along that uh, works just as well, then I'm glad to share that with you too. So that is your Obagi, the foaming gel and the gentle uh, toner. All right, scooting right along. Let's talk Estee Lauder. Hello. This serum, I will say, um, in my younger days was out of my reach as far as the price goes. And right now, I will say it's even a bit of a splurge because it's not the least inexpensive serum that you will ever use. But I do find that the hydration that it gives you whether it is, you know, in this case, on my hand, whether it is under your eye, which is where I love to use it, whether it is maybe you get dry on the sides of your nose or in between your brow line or after you, um, you know, have had a threading done or after you've had a uh, waxing done. This just to me is the most amazing restorative uh, serum and I just love it. So I even have it in the travel size. I don't think I put that in your carousel, the regular size in your carousel. So I will say, so I started off saying that it was a little out of my reach because it is, um, you know, it's not the least expensive serum that you're ever gonna use. But when you find something that really works, I can say with certainty that it is worth the value. I mean, why try 30 different types of something uh, and, and spend your money there when you could spend a little bit more, get something that really delivers and gives you those benefits. And that's for me personally. It might be different, um, you know, with different skin types, but this has been around for many, many years and many, many people uh, swear by it. You can obviously see for yourself with uh, the comments. But what's great about this is that you've got something that is a great moisturizer, a great hydrator, a great plumper, and uh, works in so many different ways. I just put it right on top of the makeup that I have on and it doesn't, um, it's not oily like it's gonna smear that off or wipe that off. It just um, is a great companion. So whether you're layering it on top, uh, which is not really the preferred method, right? You wanna put that on nice clean skin, but it is a great solution and it is the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. So if you wanna try it, let me encourage you to add it to your cart right now. All right, coming up next, let's do a um, quick little recap. 
because we're now about 30 minutes into our conversation. So I'm going to just kind of remind you about some of the things we've talked about. Uh, starting at the top, talk dirty to me. This is for your hair if you are wanting to uh, have that uh, in between dry shampoo. You can see I put it on this side of my hair. It's given a nice little lift. It still has movement. It's not that weird, uh, you know, hairspray frozen kind of look. And um, really love this. I've tried lots of different dry shampoos. Even years ago, I would just use baby powder. Nothing wrong with that, but there's some small difference between what baby powder is gonna do, which just kind of um, changes the color a little bit, especially if you have um, color in your hair like I do. Um, it, you know, it, it plays with it a little bit, especially in different light. Not when you have a dedicated uh, dry shampoo, like with the Talk Dirty To Me. I love this. Like I said, I've tried a lot of them. This one just works, and it works for days. So not that we want to talk about not washing our hair for, you know, extended periods of time. However, <laughs> if you are a busy mom like I am, and if, you know, life just happens that way, or if you... Uh, you know, just need to know that this is going to be the solution if you got to go that extra day or two in between washes. So there you have it. All right. Now, on the other end of the hair spectrum, and that would be the uh, bottom end, we're going to use the Chai Silk Infusion. So this is for you if you have split ends, dry ends, if you have hair that is um, like mine color treated and color treated maybe for a number of years. Maybe you use heating tools on it or a you know, flat iron on it. This is gonna be great whether you are 16 or whether you are you know, well into your beauty regime. So what I love is that it gives you the ability to style without uh, having to just use hairspray and you can see how it kind of allows you to sort of place it where you want it to be. I was kind of doing a little bit of this earlier and I think you get the idea there of um, suddenly now it gives the illusion that those ends are not quite as desperately in need of trimming as they actually are. <laughs> And uh, so if like me, you're going a little bit uh, farther in between visiting the hair salon and the stylist, this is uh, going to be a great extender. It's also great, uh, I find, just to give the look of uh, you know, healthier looking hair. I love it. And oftentimes I'll use it here as well because where my hair just gets a little fried from using the, um, you know, the tools and heating elements there. But I only use it on the ends. So again, because my hair is oily on the top, I wouldn't ever want to use that closer to the top of your hair, to your roots. You'd want to use that more toward, uh, toward the end of your hair. So that is the Chi Silk Infusion. All right, then we talked about our fashion secrets, Hollywood fashion secrets, with the tape. And as you can see, holding tight, here is where I use the tape on my skin so that you can see that you can hold a, um, piece of clothing or whatever the case might be, cloth, to your skin, but also then to uh, fabric on fabric. So I've done that here as well. So that's gonna hold tight until I'm ready to take it off. And as a matter of fact, with shirts that I've um, worn more than once before I send them to the dry cleaner, I'll find a second time that I've maybe put them on that uh, I was like, oh, that tape is still holding that, you know, in between that button in place and it you know could have been a week or so since I've worn that shirt or you know or longer if I just wore it for a couple hours and hung it up in the closet. Okay. All right. Good hydration is always good for beauty, right? <laughs> All right, now let's talk next about Pry. And a quick reminder, Pry is our ageless decolletage cream. We talked about using that in this area, no matter how young you are, you're never too young to begin. And no matter how old you are, it's never too late to start as well with Pry. Great skincare line, great people. If you are looking for a great way to create some tan, uh, or the illusion of tan, here is the clearance. And that's gonna be our self tanning look. All right. And then, the Obagi, of course, if you're looking for great skincare, this is gonna be a great solution for you. Both the foaming gel and the toner available. This is what I use and have used for more than 17, 18 years. 
for my skincare. It's getting a little warm in our bathroom. So I'm gonna just put on a little powder. I, uh, I'm just gonna powder down. Now I'm gonna do a whole separate show for you when it comes to makeup. Um, so I'll share with you some of those secrets later on. But a little powder. And off we go. Okay. We're gonna do makeup tips one day and I'll show you how I've been able to stack and layer makeup for 10 shows in a day. <laughs> oh, and then finally wash it off and start all over for the next <laughs> for the next round. But that'll get us through for right now. Okay, now let's talk about um, Estee Lauder, the Advanced Night Repair. That's the one that I just put underneath my eyes. And I actually had the powder that I just put on a moment ago um, already on my skin. So uh, you can see that with the, with the Estee Lauder, it, you can put it right on top of products as well as underneath, and you've got dual benefits there, which is really cool. All right, now let's move forward. What's coming up next? We're going to talk about one of my favorite tools. This is going to be a great little beauty gadget that is going to allow you to have beautiful brows no matter uh, whether you just got back from the salon and you want to do a little touch up yourself or whether you are in between having your brows uh, done with uh, threading like I do or whether you uh, maybe pluck them yourself with a uh, with tweezers this is going to be a great solution for you so as you can see it just folds right into place and then opens up and then now I'll show you how you can use this just put a little more powder on. It's getting warmer in here. You wouldn't normally powder down before you would use it. Just a little warm in our bathroom. Okay, so you can either, if you want to use it on the baby hairs on the top, you can do that. Or this is the real key, I think. You want to use it underneath. So go really slowly and gently at first. I don't have a lot of hair to take out of there because I've already used this. But you can angle it, because of the angle, you can angle it right around the shape of your eyebrow, which is really super cool. So I think you'll really like that. And, and again, you want to just move it very ever so gently on your skin, and you'll be able to just have that perfect curvature around. So if you're looking for something that you can do at home, where you don't have to go to the salon, um, or maybe in between as well, this is gonna be a great solution for those brows. Love it. Okay, if like me, um, you have worn acrylic nails or uh, nails of any sort with the dip, with the, there's so many different kinds, right? And you find you always need something in between. I took off my acrylic nails for the first time in more years than I care to talk about, 30 some years. And uh, this little gadget is something that I've had in my toolkit for decades because there's always that teeny little hangnail and then you're tempted to pull it and it, oh, so it's well worth investing in a salon quality little clippers that are specifically made for those cuticles. Don't cut them too far. Don't cut into them. Just a teeny little um, a wrap for whatever is that, you know, that hangnail and this is going to take care of it. So really important to have the right tool for that. I think these two tools are probably absolutely a, a key for you to have in your beauty regime and in your beauty collection because sometimes there's just no workaround if you don't have the right tool. So these are the right tool for very specific jobs. They're not going to work you know, in all places all over your body, but when you need them, you're going to want to have them. So great options for you there. All right, now Let's talk about some uh, restorative beauty, right? Let's talk about some things that are oh, getting warm in here. Um, let's talk about some things that can uh, give you the feeling of rest, the feeling of rejuvenation, and that is the Olbus oil. This particular oil, this particular brand I'm sharing with you now because it was introduced to me uh, more years than I care to talk about um, with uh, Cherie, my massage therapist for 
a uh, number of years when I lived in Nashville. And I didn't even know what it was the first few times when she was using it during the massage. And then finally I, I asked her, I was like, what is that amazing scent that helps me relax when I'm in here? And she said, it's all this oil. So the particular proprietary blend that is in here, um, I'm not, I don't have memorized. I can't tell you exactly what it is, but it's a beautiful aromatherapy. You can use it as a inhalant. It's relaxing. I just find it to be beautifully soothing. And how cool is it that it's available for you on Amazon, right? So if you're just looking for uh, something relaxing, I know there's lots of essential oils out there. I have lots and lots of favorites. Um, this is one that has been in sort of my beauty regime and collection for a number of years, and that's why I'm sharing it with you today. So that is the oldest oil. All right, now. Who likes to save a dime now and then, right? We all do, of course. Well, one of the biggest brands, I think, in beauty has been L'Oreal for how long now? I mean, years and years and years. I used to use a lot of very expensive hair care products, and it was brought to my attention that there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, however, if I wanted to save a dime here and now uh, and again, uh, this would be a great solution. It's L'Oreal's Nature's Therapy Mega Moisture. I have given this in gift bags. I have turned my, uh, one day at Flag at school, uh, there was a mom asking me about, what, are, you know, what do you do with your hair? It's always so shiny. I was like, you'll never guess I use Mega Moisture from L'Oreal. It is, I just think such a great secret. I want to just tell everybody about it because it is so affordable. Now, it is a deep moisture uh, conditioner. However, I use this for my daily moisturizer, or well, as we talked about with the dry shampoo. I don't have shampoo my hair daily. Um, but I use it when I do shampoo every two or three days. This is going to be the uh, conditioner that I use as the companion for the shampoo. So, look how thick that is. Can you see that? I think mean, it's just amazing, the richness that's in there. It's almost like a paste. It's kind of an idea. But it rinses out beautifully and it has the most beautiful aroma to it. And if you're looking for something, again, that is uh, something that you could use every day or every two or three days, if you have, you know, dry hair, uh, I don't use it, by the way, at the very top of my head because I have oily hair on top and uh, color treated hair. So I use it, you know, mainly from and here down and uh, and then a little extra in the ends and then of course I complement that with a chi oil should I need to have that little extra you know one two punch on the ends of my hair when it is particularly uh, damaged or in need of a cut or you know getting those split ends from using uh, styling tools and heating elements so there it is from L'Oreal one of my best tips for you to use if you're looking for something super affordable and really delivers on the promise all right, and now I'm going to round out by sharing with you a great idea for a good night's sleep. This is actually from a friend of mine who was a former uh, host with me for years uh, back in Nashville and uh, on the shopping channel there in uh, millions of homes. And she has developed this line that is available for you here on Amazon out of a personal need and necessity. It's called Quiet Brain. And she is a mother of, ooh, Laura, forgive me if I'm wrong about this, I think seven. And now a grandmother, and you would never know by looking at her, she's a very young uh, grandmother. And um, she developed this uh, because she had trouble sleeping. So she took some, uh, her journey is amazing. I'm not gonna tell it for her. I'm gonna bring her on and we're going to share this story together for you. And, uh, and uh, I'll let her share the journey because it's, it's such a um, empowering journey that she has on this. And the fruition of that journey has been the quiet brain that really delivers on, in my opinion, giving you a great night's sleep. So there are um, all kinds of articles that you can read on her store here on Amazon. It is in the carousel for you. I suggest if you want to try something that is uh, 
you know, something that you don't have to put into your mouth, this is gonna be a great option for you, quiet brain for a great night's sleep. And here's how you're gonna use it. Um, this particular one comes with a roller ball. Now, when Laura taught me how to use it, what she said is this. I've got my AirPods in, by the way, for the so you can hear me and have that microphone. So you're gonna use it right on the back of the, like where the base of your uh, skull meets your neck. So kind of in your hairline, almost, right? In there, I don't know if you can see what I'm doing. Right in there, just a little, oh, I should have put it on in the middle of the day, um, <laughs> because it really works. So um, it has a beautiful scent that is unlike any other blend that I've uh, smelled in aroma, therapy and aroma oils, and it really works. I have to tell you, it really has worked for me. Beauty products are going to be something that I think you have to you know, try and see for yourself and see if it works for you, but if you want to have that beautiful night of sleep, which is, as we all know, just like uh, getting lots of hydration, key to being beautiful, then I would highly recommend trying Quiet Brain. You can put it right into your cart and try it for yourself and I'm gonna call Laura and see if she'll come do a, a fun little Amazon live with me. That way she can personally, excuse me, answer any questions that you may have as well. All right, so let's just recap. Um, these are, oh, I forgot, it's Jamie. Jamie's here helping me out, talking beauty. She's like, don't forget about perfection. Uh, this is a line of makeup bags. Uh, there's some larger bags. I'll talk to you about those at some point in the future probably. But this um, particular line with Perspection are the makeup cases. And this is the only one I put into your carousel. There are different colors that are available for you. This is the one I use every single day. This is the one that has my makeup in it. Um, I know a little bit of my makeup in the sink that you can't see right in front of me. <laughs> um, but what I love about Perspection is that this is collapsible. So if you don't need, hello, Dallas. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. We're living live here. It's just the way it goes. <laughs> so this is um, a great makeup bag that is collapsible. Dallas, what you doing? Where's Victoria? You need her? You need her? We'll round out here. Okay, Dallas, I'm almost done. <laughs> If you're a dog lover like me, please forgive me. Uh, and if you're not, please forgive me as well. Um, so this particular makeup bag is going to be unique in that it has two large zipper pockets on either side, on the inside. Here and here you can see them. And then you've got the inside pockets. So maybe this is for your brushes and this is for your um, compacts. Maybe this is for your larger pieces uh, or your hair tools. And so mirrored on both sides, you get you know two pockets here and the big zipper pouch here. And then you have this expandable pocket on the side here. So uh, like for mine, I'll show you. I use, uh, I use that side pocket for my little fragrances that I you know, like to travel with. So you can probably put something into every little pocket so you have a space for everything. Everything has a space. You know exactly where you want it to be. And then on the outside, you've got some nice little pockets as well. So this is great if you're gonna you know, wanna have something that you grab really quickly on the outside, or maybe that's for your brushes. You choose how you wanna use it. And then it opens up here, look at that, and it zips. Now. If you have ever had a makeup bag in your purse, in your car, sitting next to you on the passenger seat, and you tap on those brakes and that makeup goes flying all over the front uh, passenger floorboard, then you're going to realize just what a great uh, little finishing touch that is to have that zipper on the top that finishes it off. So I love that. It's also great because you can use this in different ways. It doesn't just have to be for a makeup bag. This could be for, you know, a travel bag that goes with you. When uh, I was going into the studio every day, five times a day, um, and I would, you know, have all of my supplies for the shows in there. I would have my little fashion tape and I would have my little scissors. I would have my little um, clippers, my little nail clippers and my um, audio equipment for, uh, for an IFB cable. And 
and uh, you know just all those miscellaneous things. So it could be for a makeup bag, it could be for a uh, you know an overnight bag. What I like too is that you can even use it in your drawer as a drawer organizer for maybe your nighttime regime, and then you take it out. And you know, there you have your cleanser and your toner and your uh, decollete outage cream and you know whatever it is. It's all in one little area. If you have uh, a tween, if you have a teenager, if you're thinking of a great idea as a gift, I just love this. I just love this. And Julie, who is the designer, I had the good fortune of uh, getting to know a little bit a few months ago, and she really put her heart into designing these. She saw a need and she wanted to fill it. And I love that. I admire, just like Laura with the Quiet Brain, I admire women who are going out there and making a difference, seeing a need and filling it, creating something that is going to be helpful for all of us and doing it with integrity and great uh, pricing it doesn't necessarily have to be a low price it has to be a value in my opinion to uh to 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 really deliver on that promise of integrity and i think that's what julie has done here in her line of bags so i fit into the carousel for you the black one with the leopard print because it's super popular this is one that i have there are various other colors that you of course can find on amazon i think you will love this and use it time and time again again it's collapsible but yet it pops open holds its place has all those pockets on the inside all the pockets uh, additional pockets on the inside, the elasticized pockets on the end, the zip closure on the top, up here, here, let me find it, oh, that little tab twist around, easy peasy, because I know it's very easy to zip that, there you go, and you're good to go, and then these, if you want to, when you open it up, if you want to actually hold that uh, outer fabric in place, you can just snap it and hold it right in place. So, so it's very tidy. She's thought of everything when it comes to the detail and the design that uh, she's put together here, which I love. I love uh, the ingenuity of that particular bag. Now, let's see it in action, right? I'm just going to tilt this down a little bit. Hello, Dallas. <laughs> he's playing with this, my little dog. Let's just fill it up with a quick recap for you of uh, my beauty favorites that we have shown you. So we'll see if they can all fit. We'll start with the largest first. So in no particular order, here we have the L'Oreal Mega Moisture Nature's Therapy right into our purse section. So that's number one. Now let's go to our next biggest one here is probably the Cheese Silk Infusion. So quick reminder, it's Cheese Silk Infusion. That's for the ends of your hair. Uh, and that's how I use it to kind of hide the look of split ends and protect it as well. So that's the silk infusion. Now let's do the Martino Talk Dirty to Me. That is a great daily uh, shampoo, dry shampoo to use in between your actual shampoo. I love this. I love the fragrance. I love the fact that it really holds and gives you some nice body. I used it a little bit earlier and I will just say this as we're rounding out. Um, you can, it, it stays in there, but it doesn't stay super uh, crunchy like a hairspray. But you can see, even as I just kind of tease my hair a little bit, it has you know, a lift to it. And that's because of just that little amount that I put in there, uh, what, about an hour ago. So love that. And it's going to stay and it's going to hold. So there is, you know what, that one will probably end up laying down. But for now, let's leave it standing up as we're building out uh, inside our perspection. Okay, let's put the Abaji in there. Great daily skincare for the foaming gel if you're looking for a great uh, uh, cleanser to use every day, as well as the toner. They go hand in hand. I wouldn't use one without the other. And then our Clarins for your um, skin bronzer. So if you want to have that uh, the self tanner, great way to go. Stay out of the sun, take care of your skin, but still have that sun kissed look. Let's see how much. I didn't practice this ahead of time to see if this would all fit in here. <laughs> so we'll just kind of do this together. All right, then let's add in our Pry Decolletage Cream. 
and that is specifically designed for your throat and your decolletage, and that is something you can never start too young, and it's also never too late to start as well, to start using. Uh, so then, let's start to see our next biggest item would be the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. I just use this a little bit underneath my eyes. I love using it on the back of my hands. Um, you can layer it together with different items. I, right here, I get that number 11. I like to put it right on there as well. You choose uh, right here, you know, depending on where your skincare area is that you want to target, this is a great way to go with the Estee and Water Night Repair. All right, now let's get down to it. To shape your eyebrows, you can use, I'm not even using the pockets in this uh, perspection right now. So this, I'm gonna put this little tool into one of the side pockets into the perspection, which I love. And then those nail clippers, I can put right into another side. I wanna have that, right? You'd want to have these in a separate little area because they are sharp on the ends. So what's nice about perspection is that you've got those little pockets to put the items that are sharp and to group items together that you would wanna group um, and have to use together. So the two oils that we have, the Olbus oil and the Quiet Brain, I'm gonna put those together in the little area off to the side with a pouch so that uh, I know exactly where those are. So a place for everything, everything in its place. And then finally, yeah, I think that's everything we've talked about. That is the Hollywood Fashion Tape, which by the way, is still holding to my skin here and still holding to my shirt here. And uh, you know, obviously you would expect it to hold for an hour, but it could hold a whole lot longer than that. Um, and I would forget that it's even there um, until I went to sleep tonight. It's amazing that uh, it really continues to hold for such a long time. So if you really want to mend a hem or hold a certain outfit in place, this is gonna be a great uh, suggestion for you. That is the Hollywood Fashion Tape. And let's just have a home for everything and everything finds a home right in here. We will lay down our Talk Dirty To Me with our, uh, with our dirty, uh, dry shampoo. And now, check it out. I'm gonna just zip it up. And all of the products, yeah, all of the products that we've talked about in this last hour are right here inside our perspection and ready to go. So it holds a whole lot of beauty products. And so I'll round out with perspection for you, which is the uh, travel bag that you can use as a makeup bag that you can use in so many different ways for your skincare regime, your makeup re regime, you know, could be just for your wallet and your goodies to change out from purse to purse. So this is Leo. I'm gonna sign off for now and I hope you enjoy some new beauty finds here and I will see you tomorrow with